yeah, I've been doing, I've been doing art since I was wee, small, little kid, watching Saturday morning cartoons, trying to like recreate all of the things I love the best. And uh, yeah, it's just always stuck with me all the way. I was like, I was really good at it and I liked it. So, you know, people at school would be like, oh yeah, draw me the Red Ranger. And I'd be like, yeah, no problem. Bam, there's a Red Ranger. And be like, you're so cool. The first time I like sp started spraying on a wall, um, I, I knew I, I had to do more of it immediately. I make stuff that comes from my artistic background for like, you know, I'm doing, I'm painting things that I want to paint. Just happens to be that right now or for a certain piece, I'm using spray paint and I have to be doing it on a wall. Um, if that makes me a street artist, I guess that I'm a street artist, but, and if that makes that art street art, then it's street art. Die Active Art Collective is a group that was started by Laura Northway over at Daphne Spear Art Gallery. Uh, we have over 400 active members. The, the focus of the group is to create art opportunities for young artists, make art happen for them in whatever way they want, and give them the opportunity to show in, in galleries and have art creating experiences, whether that's like, you know, going painting a mural or um, learning a new skill. There's a parking lot um, of the casino. It's like right beside the Black Pirates pub. There's like a big wall. I hadn't really done anything with Die Active and, and Laura just kind of messaged me or called me up or something, which is like, hey, you should, you should come work on stuff. You should come put something on this wall. It was neat to do something that was like a part of something bigger. You know, it was really fun. It was good for what it was. Max convenience stores contacted Laura Northway over at Def's Up and there's been lots of robberies happening at the Max stores and they were trying all sorts of different things to kind of have like crime prevention initiatives with you know teaming up with Thunder Bay police and trying to get stuff happening so they could cut back on all these robberies because you know it's, you know the robberies that sucks so they came to Laura because they saw a lot of the stuff that we had been doing uh, through Die Active and Laura had approached me because I'd done a bunch of work with them, and and it was at that point that I started to become a lot more heavily involved with Die Active. Everybody loved it that walked by. People were so excited. There was like there was like one old lady that walked by who didn't really understand what was happening at first. After I talked to her for like ten minutes, trying to explain to her, and finally she she got like what we were doing back there. You know, we have people from the community coming, and we're creating something really nice and beautiful. And then after a while, she's like, Oh, oh yes. That's really nice. The, the greatest thing to me about when I get to go out and, and spray paint something is the fact that I, I make it and it's there and then it's, it's, it's very, it's unprecious, you know, as much as the piece might mean to you, as soon as it's there, it's there and um, it's not yours anymore and I like that about it. Definitely, uh, it's something I'd never want to stop, ever.